Hey everyone, it's Milan and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a pretty fun video for you guys. Um, me and my friend Doreen, she actually is Doreen Angel here on YouTube, so I will make sure to link her channel below. Um, but we went out to the Brandy Melville warehouse sale um, in Los Angeles yesterday and it was a lot of fun. It was a pretty cool experience. Um, I got a lot of good stuff for a good price. So yeah, um, basically I am just going to show you guys the vlog clips um, that I took while we were there. And then we will talk, well, I'll talk about uh, the overall experience that I had. And at the end, I will show you guys a haul of all of the items that I got. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Hey guys, so we are at the uh, Brandy Melville Los Angeles warehouse sale. Warehouse sale. <laughs> I couldn't think of the rest of the words. Um, we've been here for, oh, this is Doreen. Hi. Um, how long have we been here for? Like only, only like 30 minutes probably. Yeah. But it's 10:13 uh, now, so it's not too bad. Yeah, we got here at like 9:30, but we're the next group in line, so I think we have like another hour, and then we are going to go inside. So super excited. Yeah, I don't know what to expect, so it's gonna be really exciting. Yeah, it's it's not that bad. I'm pretty excited. But. I don't even know. so far I need to go through all of it so this is Doreen um, so we're gonna go through all of this crap right now and uh, sort out what's it? good and what's not. You have a lot more stuff than I do. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like super picky. <laughs> yeah but I'll probably end up get rid of like getting rid of some of this yeah. stuff anyway because selling it. A lot of this stuff is like um, you know, like basic stains and stuff like yeah. that. Some girl was like holding this and she was like to her friend, is this ugly? And her friend was like, yeah, and she threw it. And I was like, can I have it? <laughs> I really like yellow lately. Yeah, it's really cute. Yeah. Oh, look what I found.
back home now and I thought I would just do like sort of explain my experience um, that I had while I was there um, I'll show you guys what I got in just a second but if you want to skip forward to just see the haul skip ahead <laughs> I understand um, but me and Doreen we had a really good time it was a lot of fun honestly so I think we said this in the vlog but the wait wasn't that crazy um, I watched quite a few um, other youtubers videos like of their experience going to this and I was hearing people waiting in line for like three four hours that was not our experience though um, we honestly waited for like an hour and a half that's that's really it we got there at I think it was like 9 20 9 30 and the doors opened at 9 so we got there pretty early and yeah I don't know it it wasn't it, yeah it wasn't bad um I vlogged us going in and like what it looked like inside it was kind of crazy just because there was like tons and tons of boxes everywhere and then everyone's just like digging through them like crazy um but other than that we didn't really have any like people try to fight us or like mean people shoving or anything like that it wasn't like that intense people were pretty nice for the most part um as i we talked about this on doreen's vlog but there was this one like old lady I, I don't even think she was there with like uh her daughter or anything i think she was just there by herself she was like in her 50s <laughs> she just was like causing a whole scene and she was fighting with some teenagers over like a freaking butterfly shirt or something it was so stupid <laughs> and the security guards there like went over to them and like tried to like calm down the whole situation but the security guards weren't even like real security guards they were just guys with like fake badges in jeans like <laughs> they were so unofficial they they were like 20 year old guys probably like in college and yeah it was just ridiculous but this lady was like crazy she her face was all bright red and she was like screaming and yelling at these girls and the girls were just laughing at her because she was like trying to fight them over a freaking butterfly shirt or something and it was kind of funny because everyone was like oh people were crowding around like getting their phones trying to record it but there was nothing to record because it's not like this lady was gonna like punch some teenager or something like that um but yeah other than that it was pretty chill pretty relaxed like nothing crazy no one got into a fight like a physical fight um that would be pretty ridiculous if that happened but yeah i don't know other than that like the only thing i would say is that they don't have that wide of a variety of items. I don't know if it's because other people got there before us and they got like all of the different cool pieces or something, um, but you will see like a ton of the same stuff. So after like, you only get an hour to go in um, and like pick out the stuff, apparently. Um, I say apparently just because they said that, but like, no one is timing you like no one's going up to you like okay you gotta leave now um so i don't know i think they just like estimate that people are gonna spend an hour in there but um we did only end up spending an hour like looking through everything because so much of the stuff was like just the same thing over and over again so you kind of just are like all right there's nothing else to see so i might as well just like buy my stuff and go um but yeah that was the overall experience i'm pretty happy with the stuff that I got um, a lot of it is stuff that I was wanting to purchase anyway so now the part you have all been waiting for the haul so I spent um, exactly $100 um, I can put a picture up right here of um, how much everything costs but but I did get quite a lot of stuff for a hundred dollars so let's just get into the items all right first thing 
super cute. I've been seeing these everywhere. It's just one of these um, gingham bandeau tops. Uh, I really like this yellow color. It's so perfect for the spring and summer. Um, thought this was super duper cute. And to sort of go with it as an outfit, I got these white button up shorts. I freaking love John Galt denim. Like it fits me so well. And it's just really, really flattering and cute. I don't have a pair of white shorts yet. So I thought these would be perfect. Then I got this dress. I've actually been wanting this for a while. So I was happy to find this. Um, super cute. Just a basic red spaghetti, spaghetti strap dress. Next thing um, I got to sell on Poshmark. It is the band Circle Jerk. And it's just a band tee. This is what it looks like. Um, band tees sell really well on Poshmark, so that's why I got this. Next item, I've literally been wanting this shirt forever, so I was so happy to find it. It is just this um, Gold Coast, natives of Gold Coast cropped black t-shirt. It has it on the front and in the back. I just really, really like cropped black t-shirts right now for some reason. Also another item I had been wanting was this little flower tank top. Um, it just has like the cute little tie right there. It's sort of like a bow and the back is like scrunched up like that. Super cute. Then um, I got one pair of pants and they actually did not fit me well. So these will be on my Poshmark two they are a size small they're the john galt denim and they are just these black jeans the legs sort of like bunch up um you know they're not skinny jeans they're more like a mom jean but they're more um like mid-rise rather than high rise and then i got this tank top which i've been wanting a tank top just with this little um, cutout, oh, like with that little cutout for a while. I don't know why, I just think that makes it like really cute for some reason. Um, but yeah, that was a pretty basic item. Then, okay, they had so many of these shirts and I was really happy to get one. It's just, um, you know, the basic yellow t-shirt and then it says honey stitched on and like this gold um, embroidered fashion and I don't know I just really 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 have been loving like this sort of yellow color lately I just think it's really cute really great for the summer next item is so awesome oh there's a fuzz on it but just it speaks for itself like this awesome navy blue uh, knit rainbow stripe sweater. Oh, there's some other things on it. But, like, how cool is this? I don't even think I've seen this at, like, any of the Brandy Melville's near me. So, I got this, uh, to sell on Poshmark because it's really hot in LA and I don't really need sweaters right now. Okay, this is another shirt I have been wanting. I don't know why, I just really like the, like, college look of it, you know what I mean? And it's just like a very, very cropped um, t-shirt and it's really soft. I don't know. I just think it would be cute with like, uh, just like a pair of joggers or even a pair of skinny jeans. But I, I got it just for like a more relaxed look. I feel like with <clears throat> sweatpants or joggers, that would be really cute. All right. And then the last item is this hoodie. And it just says San Francisco, California on it. And I honestly don't know what color this is. It's almost like, it's sort of like a very muted olive green, um, like a tan olive green. I'm honestly not sure how to describe this color, but it's just an oversized hoodie. It's really soft. 
and really nice. So yeah, that is what I got at the Brandy Melville <laughs> uh, shopping outlet thingy. I don't know what to call it, but that is what I got for $100. And I just thought that was really amazing because usually you can get like a freaking pair of shorts and a shirt and then you spend a hundred dollars at Brandy Melville. So I was really, really happy with all of the items that I got. Um, a good majority of them will probably be on my Poshmark. So if you want them, go check it out. Um, but yeah, that was the whole thing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know what you liked, um, which items you liked that I got, and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one. All right, bye everyone!